Several Eurasian mythologies posit that the creation of the universe progressed through six stages. The Bible says God took six days to create the world. In Christianity, 666 is known as the number of the beast, although the book of Revelation suggests it is actually the number of man, human endeavor, and power. King Solomon symbolically collected 666 talents of gold each year. Located at the very center of the Kabbalistic Tree of Life, the Six Sephira is called Tiferet, meaning glory and compassion, or moral and physical beauty. Number six is the key to spiritual existence, as it is said to unite spirit and matter. Carbon, to wit the primary component of life on Earth, has an atomic number of six. A carbon atom is made up of six protons, six neutrons, and six electrons. As opposed to the pentagram, which only contains the five elements of the physical universe, the hexagram also includes the blueprint of reality, that is to say, the abstract dimension of the cosmos. Therefore, number six is the compound of potentiality and actuality, abstraction and concretization, the latter being but the manifestation of the former. Vav, that is the sixth letter of all Semitic writing systems, represents a hook or staff connecting heaven and earth. Likewise, two Chinese characters, similarly pronounced Wan, depict the creation of the universe and a bridge between spirit and matter, respectively. The Star of David, also known as the Seal of Solomon, is a hexagram composed of two triangles. It represents the union between opposites, as well as humankind's ability to elevate itself and reconnect to the divine. In Hinduism, six represents the double Trimurti, formed by Brahma, Vishnu and Shiva, and their respective wives, Saraswati, Lakshmi and Parvati. Not coincidentally, the sixth major arcanum of the tarot deck features the lovers. Buddhist cosmology typically identifies six scenarios of rebirth, where sentient beings are reincarnated based on their conduct in previous lives. The Shatgari or Liu Dao are the divine realm, semi-divine realm, ghostly realm, demonic realm, animal realm, and human realm. In Chinese esotericism, all the possible combinations of yin and yang are represented by a hexagram composed of six solid or broken lines. The Taoist concept of Hunduan, which means void and formlessness, has parallels in other unrelated cultures and was linked to the alchemical element of sulfur. The Chinese term Hunpo can be translated as soul or spirit. It corresponds to the very first I Ching hexagram, namely Qian, made up of six unbroken lines. The Chinese name of number six is Liu, which is homophonous with the noun for sulfur as well as a verb meaning to flow or to endure. In Chinese folk religion, number six, often tripled to enhance its effectiveness, is thought to be the luckiest number, granting success and good health. The second stage of creation was often described by the Chinese as order originated from chaos. In this particular case, order is synonymous with the concept of Tao. Taikong, meaning space-time, was characterized by Taiji, that is, a perfect balancing of forces. The newborn universe was filled with an all-pervasive light, looking like shining metal, symbolically gold or mercury. The third stage involved the birth of elementary particles with opposite charges and endowed with forces of attraction and repulsion. 
This cosmic materialization was symbolized by a tree, and consequently the element of wood and air. That's when so-called Qi first came into being. The fourth stage was marked by the interaction between particles and the formation of gaseous matter. This cosmic coalescence was symbolized by fire and yang energy. The fifth stage saw the conversion of gas into liquid state, forming nebulae, stars and protoplanets. This cosmic condensation was symbolized by the element water and in energy. The sixth and last stage of creation yielded our current universe, characterized by solid matter and carbon-based life forms. This cosmic solidification was symbolized by the elements of earth and salt. It also corresponds to the Yijin hexagram Kuan, made up of six broken lines. The Mongolian flag features the Soyombo symbol, which contains the six sacred elements of creation, from spirit at the top all the way to earth at the bottom.